<laughs> Look at that cut! Ooh, that's the wall? Yeah, that's the wall. Don't smell too much. Whoop! Okay, that's gonna knock you out. Nah! Just look at the difference. This is where we wiped, this is where we have not wiped. We were pulling up the trim board, Sean found this. Welcome to our first demo day. Yeah. Okay, today what are we doing, babe? We are going to take out this nasty carpet. So we can put in our vinyl flooring uh, here in a little bit, as in a couple more videos. We're gonna take this out and then we're gonna take out all this stuff, any of this trim between carpet and- So we're gonna be taking out room. doors, we're gonna be taking out trim, and then we're gonna be ripping this nasty carpet up. And Lexi's yeah, helping and Lexi's us mark back. the doors. Lexi's back. Definitely, Lexi's back. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely recommend labeling your doors and your trim so you know what room it goes to and what wall it goes to. See? Just like that. All right. Are we ready to get started? Let's do it. Whoop. Okay. Let's do it. <laughs> she dropped it. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes, like this house is built in this. 92 and I feel like these haven't been changed since 92 so on some of them the bolt was so stuck that we had to take it off But if you can take it off with just a bolt do it. We did it for these two bolts Those two bolts, but we couldn't get the bottom ones because it was just hard to get to yeah, so now it's time Get this nasty carpet up. So the smart way is to cut up your sections So you're hauling out sections of carpet instead of the whole room because you don't want to just scrape up all your walls because we got to finish these walls and make it look pretty. So we're not demoing everything, so we need to make it look good. So we're going to cut sections about four foot long and then just rip it up. Roll it up, toss it out. Let's do it. Roll it up, toss it out. Make the first cut. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, just do. Yep. Yeah, now just work your way back. No, just walk backwards. Yeah, like that. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that cut! That is a good cut right there. Oh. oh, keep going. You know what? Maybe we should keep the carpet. What? Ew. It's not gonna be gross underneath, it's gonna be clean. I don't know. It's clean under there. Go ahead and pull it up. God. There you go. Woo! Look at that. Now we're getting some progress. Oh. <laughs> All right, there we go. Now let's just roll it up and put it in the garage. Get it out of the way. Out of sight, out of mind. Good cuts. <laughs> now it's time to do that to the whole place. So we've got most of the carpet pulled up and the, well, we got the whole master bedroom pulled up. We we're starting on this entryway. Bree's pulling down a door right now. But I have a little tip for you guys removing these doors. At first I was opening them and I was popping them off that way, but it made it really, really difficult. So shut the door. It makes the hinges line up better. Um, I don't know why I didn't think of it, but if no one else was thinking of it. That's the reason, and that's why you should do it. So just shut the door, and then they're gonna pop right off. You don't have to unscrew anything. All right, that's my TED talk. I'm out. All right, guys, a little update. It's kind of hard to record. Um, we're gonna figure out the best way to maybe set up a tripod or something to show you guys a little bit more in depth in our future projects. But today with the carpet, well tonight, it is now 10.30. We have gotten so much done. There's Jonah, Jonah came and joined. That's the key of having good friends. We got three up there and there's Lexi. <laughs> we we ripped oh. up these Ed strips. I got staple. She's in charge of the staples. I'm telling him the staples. I got a snake in my mouth. Because you will learn the staples or the sucky part of this process. Yeah. But, come on. Come on. All right, let's see what you got. All right, watch your step. Look at those steps. All right, what All are you right, doing? So what are you working I on? I am going through the whole house and ripping up the edge strips. So after you take off the carpet, mm -hmm. and what is it called underneath the carpet? I don't know, blue phone. <laughs> but after you take off the carpet and then you also take off the padding underneath the carpet, you yeah. have to go through and then you have to rip up the edge strips. But that's only if you're putting on um, laminate flooring, we're doing luxury vinyl. You have to do it no matter what. You have to do it no matter what. 
Unless you're putting on carpet again, you can leave them. So, unless we come in through here. Also, if you have anger issues, this is a great relief if you have anger issues. So it's a great job for Bree, that's why she's on it. <laughs> All right, show show what you've done. Show what you've done. Show what you've done. So, apparently it's sticky. So, Lexi, you, you're still in the process of taking right, the staples out. The, yes. That's the last of the blue foam. Last of the blue foam. Bloom foam. Blue foam. So, we've taken the, so we've taken the carpet out. We've taken the blue foam out. I've gone around the edges and used a crowbar to take off the edges, and then Lexi has been going through and taking out the staples. So that's really important after you take off carpet, you have to get the staples up yeah. from the <laughs> ground. She has the most important job. She has the most important job. It's the hardest, the most tedious part, but it's the, the most important. So that's yeah. what we're doing right now. Because if you don't get all the staples out when you're putting in your laminate flooring, it can cause it to rise a little bit, and you don't want that. You don't want it to work. Nope. But yeah, it's a little sweaty. It's hard work. If you don't have to do a workout for the day, because this is your workout. I'm also needing some blisters. It's great. All right, now let's go into like a cool montage of Bree just ripping out that trim board. <laughs> what? All right, there you go. Hey, babe. What you say? She missed one down here. Hey! <laughs> Whoa. Okay, she'll kill you. <laughs> well, we better get out of here, dude. This is not safety zone. Get out of here. We are using shot back mm -hmm. with This is just called a sander. Yeah, so we're gonna try this. I need off that. Ooh, premium, just like me. Oh my gosh. You got anything to say about that, Lexi? Yeah, I can go with a spoon. Grab me a cup so I can have it. <laughs> what? <laughs> it looks like apple juice. <laughs> This is a great relief if you have anger issues. So it's a great job for Bree, that's why she's on it. <laughs> Show what you've done. <laughs> on the, oh my gosh, what is it called? They must have had some stressful mornings getting ready. They had to smoke a cigarette before they put on their clothes. <laughs> I might have to try that, babe. <laughs> 